solid 10 to 15 range. Wow. Okay. I'm just going to go out there and have fun. That's the big main thing for today. It's the Pro Graphics podium from last race, so we just took a picture. We're trying to get another race going. Okay, so no other Pro Graphics podium yep. today. That's what we're trying. We're going to try. Okay. Yeah. Especially you. Yeah. Yeah, definitely. We're going to try. Okay. Looks fast. And yeah. Dry. Just say that. Fast yeah. Dry. Very fast. Yeah. Very dry. Yeah. Yes. Which is typical. I mean, it's usually fast here, whether it's dry or muddy. It's one or the other. It's never like just prime. You know, prime. It's always super dry or super wet. But we'll make the best of it. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Thanks. Thank you. See you afterwards. Who? Uh, who? Now we're out of the weather again today. So uh, go get what we got. Just uh, go get what we got. All I gotta say. So. good man I've been I tell you that I've been feeling good all year um, this hasn't hasn't wound up being what we wanted it to be um, today I feel good um, the front end started making a little funny noise so I got a little worried right there at the end uh, that last lap I slowed down a bit um, man dude I feel good I'm happy I'm healthy I'm ready to go for the next one um, really excited this one just felt really good to get it so I haven't won here since 2014, so it's been a little while, and uh, felt good to be in the center. In spots it was, and I was actually thinking that when I was out there. I was anticipating on it being a little rougher, more kickers because of it being a little tacky in some spots, but, you know, people hitting their brakes in different areas and it just creating kickers, but there wasn't as many kickers as what I thought, so I was grateful for that because sometimes it, they sneak up on you. Pretty good, but by God, come on, this is the heartbeat of America, the Midwest, Indiana, my home. I love it here, you love it here. I'm gonna ask you one more time. Are you ready to go GNCC Racing? <laughs> 10 seconds for row number one, the XC1 Pro. Bang! And we're off as our riders jockey for position in turn number one. It's chaos, it's pandemonium, but it means nothing to the number nine of Jared McClure, the Cobra, goes up and grabs it.
This will be win number 21 for Bryson Neal, and that ties him yep. with the great Chuck DeLulo. For his best finish of 2023 in the number two spot, finally gets that podium. The Gator is <laughs> off. Oh, yeah. Look at him. It's, it's a little bit more fun racing, you know. Uh, the past two races have been just not fun, you know, and uh, it's, it's nice to get out here, have a good track, get out, go, do some good laps for Adam. He was riding great, so uh, got, a, got a great start. Just, uh, man, just did my thing today. Just tried to ride. It's Phoenix Racing ATV Yamaha. It, it clicked off all day long. CST tires, how's their A-arms, up with shocks. Everything was working great today, so we're just happy for the team, for the fans, for everyone who's got my back. It's a good day. It, it definitely felt, I never, I never felt, I never really felt fast today. I just, I just rode, you know, today. I was just clicking off laps and, and I, I was trying to be smooth because the track was honestly a little bit sketchy. When I looked at it yesterday, I thought it was just going to be just blue groove, wide open, but it actually got a little bit more deeper, a little bit more spongy, a little bit more deeper ruts than I thought I was going to get. So uh, you actually had to stay on your toes on this one today. So we're pumped though. It's a good, good day. Thank you, man. Look good. Yeah, it's going to be a long It will be, baby. That's going to be the longest six hours home. I promise you that. <laughs> Good job, brother. Proud of you, man. That's right, anytime. <laughs> Good job. Brother. I mean, always had to do this ever since he grew up. <laughs> it's, it means a lot, man. I mean, we just, it's been, I wouldn't say struggling, but this year definitely been something different. I don't know if, like, the hunger's back. I, I don't know if it's, it's weird because everything almost goes in five with me. And this is, you know, my fifth year with Obor and, and all that. And I I don't know what to say. It's just, I'm speechless. I am so happy. And hey, maybe this is a sign of good things to come. The old dog's not learning new tricks. He's just bringing the old ones back for these young kids. My front brakes were fading all day. It was, I, it was pissing me off. It was frustrating. But uh, I had enough of them to, to make it happen still. Um, I got off the line decent, but I, I fell so far back. I know Hunter had a bad start, but uh, I fell pretty far back. and um, we, I made my way through the pack the first time. I think I was running like fifth or fourth maybe, first couple laps. And then uh, one lap before we crossed one of the creeks, I just stuffed it into this berm and went right over the bars, landed in the mud. And, uh, Hunter and Wyatt got around me. And then uh, I think Wyatt ended up getting in a tree, having some issues, bending some stuff up. And then just that last lap, me and Hunter were rolling out. We, I felt like we were rolling pretty good. Uh, I had a line that – there was a couple lines I was trying to get around them. Uh, we came together on the MX track. I mean, I was trying everything. But uh, I got around them on that line and just made no mistakes the rest of the lap and rode it home for the podium. Yeah. Can't, I mean, you can't beat a glass cheer wine. It tastes better than that. For sure. Thanks. C1 Pro ATV Podium. Thanks so much for your XC1 Pro Podium one more time. The old dog's woken up. He's coming for you. Make some noise for the Gator one more time. Let's see if he knows how to do it. Make some noise, ladies and gentlemen. Champagne spraying out here at the Hoosier GNCC. That's what it's all about. Put your hands together for the XC2 Pro-Am ATV podium here from the Hoosier.